quick before the video gets started, just want to let you guys know the M&J TV merch store where you can find designs like the one I am wearing right now is closing forever on February 12th, meaning that the designs currently found in the store are going away permanently on February 12th, 2018. So if you want some M&J TV merch, you have until then to pick it up. And now is definitely a good time to do it because it's your last chance, but also because the entire store is discounted 10%. And if you use this code at checkout, you'll get an extra 10% off. So it's a really good deal. So if you want some M&J TV merch before it goes away permanently, head to the link down in the description below and pick up some M&J TV merch before it's gone forever. Greetings, Spooky fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon Insurgents. Let's play my very first journey through this critically acclaimed Pokemon fan game. If you have been enjoying this series, don't forget to drop a like. Make sure you get to the comment question if you missed the last episode. You should check it out so you know what the heck is going on. And speaking of what the heck is going on, here's what the heck is going on! Uh, at the end of last episode, I talked about how I wanted to trade this guy, this funny looking guy right here, for his Delta Lotad. Um which he just wants any dragon type Pokemon. I actually went and caught a Vibrava in the desert to trade to him, but I did a bit of research on Delta Lotad and I realized he learns Water Pulse at like level 20 something. And if I trade him a Vibrava that's level 35, 36, it's not going to know Water Pulse because it's learned too many moves. And since the other water move that it knows in the meantime kind of sucks, it's actually better if I trade it a lower level dragon type Pokemon. And as you can see by the layout, Slash is the best Pokemon for that. Um, and I know I said I wasn't going to trade away my Axew because it was like, oh, who knows when I can get another one. But I looked it up and that cavern in the desert, it's like a 25% chance encounter rate. So I can get another one if I really want one. Um, so we're going to trade him Axew. Um, and then I'm gonna cut away to do some, I don't know, grinding to catch it up to the rest of the team, and also, uh, because I really need to catch my team up. <laughs> but let's talk to this guy. I'll trade you my Delta Lotad for any Dragon type. All right, you're not holding an item, are you? No, you're not. All right, bye, Slash. I'm speeding this up. And that, guys, is a Delta Lotad Demix. That is a cool name. It is a... I'm not, like, acting surprised because I looked up information ahead of time, but it is a Water Psychic type. So that is why it is replacing Swoobat on the team for now. I have done a little bit of research. There's some other Deltas I might use in place of this Lotad, but for the time being, I want to use this Lotad. And I also want to evolve it before we do any grinding just because there's like a move that only Lombre can learn, and I definitely want to make sure it knows that. Um, where are my rare candies? Is that That's going to be in the medicine pocket, isn't it? Ooh, the ability capsule. What ability does it have? It's got synchronized. Dang it, I was hoping it had magic bounce. If I decide to keep it around, I might use this ability capsule on it and make its ability uh, magic bounce instead. I'll think about it. Um, but where are my rare candies? I know I have at least one. Oh, they're further up. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and use one on it just to make sure, like, the auto note doesn't, like, shoot its level past the level where... Uh, Delta Lombre learns Aura Sphere at level 36, which is like, I want to make sure it's a Lombre before it gets to 36 because, you know, it's a nice coverage move. And I'm speeding this up because evolution takes way too long in this game. <laughs> there we go, our It's a Wizard! Demix is a Wizard with a beard. Actually, I think this is a girl, <laughs> which is kind of funny. Oh, they have such a clearly masculine design. Psyshock! Oh, nice! Heck yeah! Trainment? I don't want to give anybody freaking synchronize. That'd be dumb. Cool. Alright, guys. I'm going to cut away to do some Autono grinding, and I will be back. And we're back. That took way longer than I thought it was going to. It took me like 15, almost 20 minutes. Um, but we're here now. Uh, and the first thing we're going to do... Well, the first thing I should do is I should show you what I did to the team. I got everybody up to about 44, 45. Because... 
That's probably what the Pokemon I'm about to be fighting are gonna be, if not higher, because this game is insane. <laughs> uh, no new moves for her. Uh, Demix's moves had drastically changed, but we're about to evolve Demix into a Delta Ludicolo because it has moved, it has learned all of its level up moves possible. So that's pretty cool. Uh, same for him, same, same. And Snoop learned Sludge Bomb, uh, which is a large improvement over Sludge. So that's what the squad brunch is looking like right now, but we're gonna evolve Demix and then we're gonna go back to the sewers and I have a map open on the side. If my face looks like more like whitewash than it normally does, like the lighting, the camera lighting, it's because uh, I have the Insurgents wiki open because I need a map. <laughs> Delta Ludicolo looks like an old man, and it's a girl. <laughs> but all right. Um, yeah, I definitely this team is not final. There's a pretty solid chance I'm gonna replace Mono at some point because Mono Ghost Normal is great defensively, but it's awful offensively. Like right now, my only Pokemon that can handle like. I have no po like dark fighting types, so like Scrafties. I have no Pokemon that can handle them right now. Not a single one. Every single one, every single member of my team except Sonora, like four of my five team members are weak to Scrafties. So uh, I'd like to change that. I'd like to get a Fairy type on the team, but okay. Apparently, there's a flashlight down here. If the player is having trouble where to seeing where to go in the sewers, there's a flashlight located in the room straight up, right, down, and left. Up? What? Where do I enter? Oh, okay. Oh, I forgot about wild Pokemon. Gosh dang it. What are my repels? Up, right, down, and left. Oh. Okay, I got the flash of how I use it. Oh, that's much nicer. Okay, cool. Uh, quickest way to do this, starting from the department store. Okay, we have to go back to where we were so I know where to go. <laughs> what was that? There's a hyper potion sitting there. Okay. This is the department store. Go up, left, up, right, up, right. Until the player stands next to a pool of liquid. Oh, okay. Left. I think we're almost there. Okay, this is the fan. I found that earlier, I just didn't want to go there. I thought the black market was in the sewers, but it's not. What the heck? Yo, Michael, what am I standing on? This black market is creepy as heck. Glad you found your way down here too. From what I've heard, one of the cults has a hideout in here that leads directly into the Jade Tower. Let's try to sneak through, but we need to hurry. He could get attacked at any minute. I, I spent a while, we're, we're fine. I don't think anything's gonna happen without me being there. Okay, what all is here? There's a whole town down here. Ultra Ball? Hello, ma'am. My name is Witch Doctor. I have a special powder that allows Pokemon to make contact with another world. I'll let you use it for free if you'd like. I think I read that that's how you evolve trade Pokemon. A thin blue liquid seeps from beneath the door. That's nasty. 
ammo. I can create a custom move? You and your Pokemon custom moves are illegal now, unfortunately, which is why I had to move down here. I don't want to get caught, so I won't make any more than one, you hear? You can change it and teach it to however amount of Pokemon you want, though. It'll always be physical, and you can't use it online. Oh, weird. It'll always be physical. Well, let's teach it to Sonora. Oh, that's a lot. Uh, fairy would be good. I don't have any fairy coverage. Oh, no. Change name. Let's call it... Uh... Sprinkle Blast. Dang it. Let's call it... Twinkle Blast. What's a good fairy type thing? I want, I want some good and good and fairy like good and good and uh, good and Tinker Blast. There we go. That works. Tinker Blast. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and teach it. It'd be nice to have some. Uh, It'd be nice to have some fairy coverage. So let's teach it to Sonora. Sony base power. Okay, yeah, that's nice. I think I should just get rid of submission because minimize can come in handy in certain situations. I want Santum to be around for residual damage. Earthquake obviously is staying. And submissions, like, it's 80 base power and does recoil. And I have other fighting type moves on the team in, like, on two other Pokemon. So I think this makes the most sense. Alright, well, I just spent $5,000 to get some fairy coverage, so that's nice. We'll see how long that sticks around. What is that? Is that blood? Yikes. Hello, sir! If you want me, I can hack your com Pokemon's computer storage system to increase its space. Uh, no, I'm good. I have enough space for now. Maybe later. I just talked to that guy. Did I go in this house? Oh, that was the thin blue liquid. <laughs> Creepy. How do I... Ugh, mm. Oh, timer balls. Chill drive. Sashay. Lots of random items here. Moo Moo Milk. Whoa! Okay. A black sledge for only 200? Oh, that's helpful. Yeah, I'll take that. King's Rock for only 100? Light ball for only 100. Some good deals down here! Shouldn't go to a black market in real life! <laughs> experience share! Okay, so it's the old kind of experience share. Super rod for free! Ah, sick! Ultra ball, I think that's the regular price, so that's not that enticing. The timer balls, though. Oval charm, dusk ball. That could be useful. I'll buy a couple. You can buy fossils. I don't even know where you revive fossils, though. You had timer balls? I should buy timer balls. Man, you really do need 
every bit of money you can every bit of money you can get in this game. Whoa, what the heck is going on here? Betting is a huge deal in the black market. It's technically not a lot above ground, so people try and make some cash here. It's not exactly a fight to the faint here. Oh my god, Pokemon fight to the death here? Fight back, dang it, I bet good money on you. Tear him to shreds. Come on, Grandma, I train you better than this. If you want food, you better win. Jeez. Yeah, kill him, Mighty Anna. I, I mean, uh, go, Mighty Anna, make the faint. Well, making the dark playthrough was uh, certainly accurate. My goodness. Find Michael Vick down here. Who's this? Oh, I want to give that black sludge to, uh... You should be given to someone. I'm surprised I haven't done that yet. We'll give it to you, Mr. Tank, and Black Sludge to, uh... I should sell that pearl. I completely forgot. We're gonna give you to, uh, the poison type that I have. Let me real quick sell this pearl. Sell... Well, that was less than I thought it was going to be. Whatever. <laughs> I need a big pearl. Well, this looks correct. What the heck is this? Uh-oh. Things are getting spicy, I can tell. Who's there? This area is off limits. Oh, it's you. Michael, you were that kid from Suntouched Gym, weren't you? What do you want? You here to avenge your gym leader friend? Get out of here now, you... Tain, hold on a minute. S sir? I suppose you two don't remember me, huh? My name is Rukra. I'm the leader of the Perfection Cult. We've met each other in Telnor Town, back in Sylvan F Sylvan's lab. I remember you! Remember the Delta Species Pokemon I offered you? I'm glad you chose to travel with one. Every Pokemon deserves to adventure with a trainer. You are on private property. I'm forced to ask you to leave. We are busy right now, and we really can't be distracted. I don't much care for you two myself, and if I had it my way, I'd get rid of you two immediately. As a favor to my old colleague, Professor Sylvan, I'd rather do this the easy way. Well, we don't really want, really want to interfere with anything. We just want to get through. Oh, that's Damien, sorry. We just want to get through. We heard there was a way into the Jade Tower from here. We need to see the auger. And why would you two want to do that? Because the Sky Cult is coming for him. He's in big trouble. Is he now? Tell me, why should I help save him? I'm a cultist, Damien. More than that, I'm a cult leader. Jaren's been after me for ages. Why wouldn't I want him out of the way? I... I don't know. I just thought you would... Actually, I take that back. Let's strike a deal. I have a little project you can help with. Okay. To be honest, we're not really a cult. There are legendary Pokemon we'd like, certainly, but none that we worship. Our group was founded in the pursuit of a single goal. Perfection. A truly perfect Pokemon. One that is undefeated and inconquerable. One with no counters and no move or strategy can stop it. All of our plans have been centered around this vision. Delta Pokemon. We thought certain Pokemon might be stronger with different types, different moves. Now we're trying something else. In the Kalos region, a new battle technique was discovered. It's become common practice now, but how it works is still a mystery to scientists today. This is called Mega Evolution. We need to understand it completely. That way, we can use it for our own purposes. Tayan has a Mega Pokemon with a Mega Stone on his team right now. We want data. If you battle against Tayan, we can analyze how well his Mega Evolution does in battle and how it can be improved. Fight Tayan, and we'll let you pass through. You're right, you can get into the Jade Tower from here. Oh, but, Rico, we don't have time. What if this guy. Don't worry, we'll make this fast. Michael, show me what you've got. Fantastic! <laughs> Hello, sir. Well, oh my god, that's terrifying. Uh, well, I actually think it might be a good idea to stick around, because ice does neutral on him, because ice resists ice. 
and he's a dragon type. But I resist his ice attacks. So let's see how this goes. Haha, -ha, that did better than I expected. Let's spam double team. Dang it. One more. Are you kidding me? Not a single freaking miss, even though I'm... Ugh. There we go, finally. All right, what do I have selected? Ice Beam. Dude. I don't like this at all. <laughs> Using too many potions. Aha, aha! All right, I used a lot of potions, but it's fine, this is Important stuff here. In prison? No. Yes. No, that's a horrible move. Pyroar! Oh man, now we have to switch. Okay, uh... This is a job for... Let's, do, let's see how Demix does. I wanna use Demix. Meow! Alright, Water Spout. Booyah! Stunfisk, ground electric, weak to ground. <laughs> Tinker Blast. <laughs> what the heck? What the heck? <laughs> well, this is fantastic. I don't know who to use. I have no idea what this thing's stats are. Let's bring in Mono and hope we tank a Muddy Water and then can KO with Fake Out. Well, let's hope this works. Oh, we outspeed. Okay, sweet. All right, didn't matter. Grumpig. Now we'll just leave. All right, we're just gonna switch in case this guy doesn't heal my team. Ha! Oops. I knew there were custom Megas in this game. I was not expecting Stunfisk to be the one that had it. How could you win? Thank you very much, Michael. You may pass. The entrance to the Jade Tower is just up the stairs. You know what? Take one of these two. Whoa! Now we can Mega Evolve! All battles you do will be recorded and sent to us. Don't worry, we're not spying on you. We only want data on Mega Evolution. Wow. Regret. Thank you. Don't get used to it. I'm not doing this for you. Now get going. I thought you were in a hurry. Michael, let's go. You heard him. It's up the stairs. Are they going to heal my Pokemon? No, they're not. No, they're not! They're not gonna heal my Pokemon! Stupid game! Freaking come on. I'm so annoyed they're not healing my team. I should use super potions. Why don't they heal my team after a battle like that? Close enough. Well. Did I just read what I just thought I read? Holy crap!
Where's someone for me to fight? <laughs> okay, I know I have the Darkrai Cultist thing, but that's not gonna work. But I need. Where's someone I can fight? Let me through this door. Hello! Maybe I shouldn't start this right now, but I need to see. Fight me, lady! Get out of here, the Sky Cult is taking over. All right, we're gonna do this one battle, then we're gonna wrap things up. Hello, lady. Dang it, we're way to you. Ugh. All right, never mind. I should probably just make the long trek back to heal anyways. I'm low on PP. Toge kiss. Dang it, let me use Blast Voice. Yeah, all right, I'm definitely gonna like off camera leave and heal because my team is uh Shouldn't even use those hyper potions shell gun. All right, that's something I can uh, do at least neutral damage with Z Well, I need to map a button on this to that Let's go for dark pulse Whoa! Why am I so far to the side? <laughs> that was awesome! Iron def- no. Okay, I'm gonna leave, but I'm, I'm, I'm coming back. Pokedex, is it gonna show me, like, can I see sprites? Is there no way to view the mega? Man. That was sick though. I'm looking forward to using that in the future. But guys, I should probably wrap this up now. I need to go back and heal. Um and that's really what I just need to do. But we're, uh, thanks for getting spicy. I'm very much looking forward to continuing it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like. Make sure to answer the comment question. And that is all I have for now. So until next time, Pokefans. Gotta catch them all.